Hello YouTube, this is Barry with Zero Bite in Flight. After posting my last video, I did a, a musical montage of my touch and go practice last weekend, and Flight Chops was good enough to stop by and post some thoughts on it. He noticed something that was happening that each time I landed there was a little bit of a swerve to the left and, and said that, you know, maybe I should think about it and, and where it comes from. And that got me thinking, you know, why, why was it happening? And the short answer is because I don't use enough right rudder during my landing. And if I had a dollar for every time my instructor said right rudder, then I'd probably have a whole three hour of flight by now. Just a little more right rudder. You uh -oh. still need more right rudder. You gotta get more right rudder. See yeah. the nose? Okay, you still don't have enough right rudder in. Look at your ball. There you go. A little more right rudder. Put your nose back. Right rudder. Right rudder. More right rudder. More right rudder. More right rudder, more right rudder. You gotta put in more right rudder, we're landing sideways again. Okay. So it looks like you got some left aileron in, so that means when we go down to land, you'll need to do what with the rudder? Right, right rudder. Story of my life. Yeah, well. I'm gonna give you a Christmas. Ouch, right? I even tell myself right rudder. Follow full, right rudder. Well, obviously I know what I'm supposed to do. I'm just not doing it. Now I just have to figure out why that is. Yeah, I get like a perspective thing going on that I'm doing wrong and okay. And I'm having trouble judging when it's coming straight, straight, straight at me. Well, it turns out that perspective has everything to do with it. You see, one of my problems is that when I'm at the moment of landing, my focus of vision is in the wrong place. I'm actually looking too close to the airplane. Not only that, but I'm looking over the spinner of the plane. So as you can see, my line of vision points here. And if you extend that center line of vision onto the horizon, it looks like I'm pretty close to dead on from where I'm sitting. Now, here's where the plane's really pointing. Quite a difference, huh? So then if I change the place where I'm looking to be straight ahead of me and at the horizon, then I would have been able to easily see that I was yelled off to the left, just like Scott did. Now let's check out some landings from the video. Yep, looks like that one's off. And again, there we go. But they're not all bad. I did have some good landings and this is one of my best ones. So how'd I do? Almost perfect. Well, there you have it. Look in the right place to get the right yaw. I'd like to thank Flight Chops for inspiring this video. Okay, you still don't have enough right rudder in. Look at your ball. <laughs>